Well, if you've been wanting to learn how to can cranberry sauce, then you need to follow me into my kitchen so I can show you how. So let's go ahead and get started. Good day. Today, I'm going to show you how I make cranberry sauce. And I was in my pantry this year for Thanksgiving. Pulled out a few jars of what I have put up from last year. And I'm coming down to the last few jars. And it's that time of year again for me to put up a whole bunch more. Because this is one thing my family does go through a lot of. We do love our cranberry sauce. So I'm going to bring you along. So, okay. I measured out 12 cups in my Dutch oven here and now we're going to be needing to add one and a half cups of uh, orange juice and I use the pulp So let's go ahead and add that. And now we're going to take this over to the stove and we're going to put it on medium heat and we're going to cook, get down and we're going to let the skins on the Cranberries, they're going to start to pop and stuff. You should start to hear the cranberries starting to pop. And keep stirring this ever so often, too. Okay, when my sauce comes to start looking like this, I reach for my immersion blender and I'm going to give it a few zips with that and then I'm going to put this back up on the stove bring this back up to a boil and then that's when I'm going to add the six cups of sugar next and then we're going to sit there and let that boil for three minutes so the sugar all dissolves and then we're it's time for us to ladle it into our jars. It's all nice and whole just like what you would get in the store bought ones but when we're canning it I just want to give you a little tidbit. Make sure you do it in the wide mouth. That way when you open this up and you pop the lid, you could just dump it right out onto your uh, serving dish. Like what? Okay, let's go ahead and ladle it up. You're gonna wanna leave one fourth inch head space. And then go ahead, wipe the rim of our jar off. And then grab a canning lid, place that on. Grab your canning ring, finger tighten that on. And go ahead, put this in a hot water bath canner and process this for 15 minutes. And there 
you go. Homemade cranberry uh, sauce. You can either have a full or you can have it as what I have here. And as you see, it thickened up really nice. 